After the incredible success of the first two installments of Telltale Games' take on the popular Walking Dead franchise, the third episode has a lot to live up to. Considering all they've been through, are there still enough reasons to continue down the road with Lee Everett and his ragtag band of survivors? Yes. The story picks up not long after the events of the second episode, with supplies still running low and the seeds of mistrust nearing full blossom. Missing items turn friends against each other as the survivors pick the town of Macon clean, and after the tension builds to a head, the story begins moving in the literal sense for the first time since the band of survivors reached the Travelier Motel. Long Road Ahead is the most adventure-oriented episode of the three, and while there's some first-person shooting action and fisticuffs in store for action-loving players, exploration and interaction take center stage here. It's a welcome touch, but these sequences are never as challenging as the search for the keys that gave some players a hard time in the first episode, revealing a preference for keeping the plot moving. Long Road Ahead also suffers from some minor pacing issues, most notably while trying to get an abandoned train moving again. And although there's a cliffhanger waiting at the end, it lacks the power of the moral choice that concluded the previous installment. I'll believe it when I see it. Yet for all that, Long Road Ahead delivers the most powerful emotional punch of the series thus far. There are some genuine surprises here, along with a fresh batch of characters to make up for the companions who will inevitably drop out of the picture. <laughs> Long Road Ahead is further proof of Telltale's skill at reinvigorating the zombie game by de-emphasizing the zombies, and it's a journey worth taking. As with its predecessors, it's a rare game that earns its difficulty through the weight of its decisions rather than its gameplay, and it sets an increasingly high bar for narrative excellence in video games. Fuck. We don't got many of those. See this and other GT shows and game reviews on the GT Originals iOS app, available now on the App Store.